Okay, um, now we are going to be looking at a very important question that sometimes I've been asked to students. Maybe you are writing advanced level in Cameroon, maybe you are out of the country. Most of the time, this question is always a problem to the student body. So, um, there's a question. They say, link the term scarcity to opportunity cost. This is a very important question. Many people sometimes are very confused when a question comes like this. I want to clarify you, I want to explain to you for you to get a proper understanding of this question. Now, first, what would you do? You define the term scarcity. You say scarcity refers to limited in supply or relative to demand, or scarcity is limited in supply and relative to demand. That is, that resources are not available at the moment or are not available at all to reach all the needs or the wants of individuals. That's the full meaning of scarcity. And you have to understand that scarcity is different from shortage. Scarcity is a permanent situation that affects all economics of the world. Why shortage is a temporal situation that affects some economics of the world. I mean, and shortage, it can be covered up in, in, in less than no time. The scarcity, it is in the long run. Let's say, for example, I was selling shoes in the market and they bought all the shoes, but I still have some in the house. Actually, we call that shortage. But scarcity there means I was selling the shoes, they are completely finished and they are not in the house. That means the resources are not available at all. And when there is scarcity, man is bound to make what is known as what? Choices. Now, choice is the act of selecting between two or more alternatives. And when you are selecting between two or more alternatives, you need to come up with what is known as what? The scale of preference. Now, I would like to demonstrate before I go to what is known as the scale of preference. Now, this is your scale of preference. You, for a student, you have bar, you have pen, you have pen, you have um, um, shoes, and then you have books. This is a scale of preference. The scale of preference then explains to us the list of unsatisfied ones arranged in order of importance. That is the most important at the top and the least at the bottom. Let's say for a student, the first thing you will need is a book, um, a bag, a pen, and a shoe. Then let's say for example, yeah, and then you forgo a, a, a book. Now, the skill of preference is a list of unsatisfied ones. That means we are taking the, the most pressing at the top and then the least at the bottom. Now, in as much as man is bound to make a choice, as I was explaining for choice, he has to come up with the scale of preference. And after choice has been made out of your scale of preference, what is left is known as opportunity cost. Opportunity cost then is the next best foregone alternative. Thank you viewers for watching this very wonderful video on Benjamin Academics. Please click our sub um, subscription button if you see the video interesting to get more in as much as our videos are concerned. Our comment box is there for you to tell us what you think about the video so we can, come, we can um, arrange our next coming videos and our um, 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 sharing box is as a way there for you to be, create awareness about our video. You are very much welcome to Benjamin Academics if you are viewing us for the very first time. Please like, share, subscribe. Thank you.